guys! So this video is going to be a little bit different than um, the videos that I normally post. This isn't going to be a health related video at all. Um, I just wanted to do a bit of a favorite things video for 2015. So I've got a few things that I wanted to show you guys. I've always just watched favorite things videos and really enjoyed them and have found things that I've liked through them. So I wanted to make one for myself and hopefully some of these things are things that you guys might like too. So the first thing that I want to show you guys is a concealer and it's by Avita. I don't know if you can see that. Yeah, there. Um, my cousin actually had this and I tried it hers and I really liked it so I ended up getting my own. It's called Avita Inner Light Concealer and it's like got like a little brush on type thing. One of these that you can use but I actually end up not using it much. I kind of put it on my hand and then just use my finger. Um, but I really like it because it's natural and I find the coverage is really good and if you're going through um, Lyme treatment or any type of infection treatment, you might be doing a lot of detoxing which can make your skin look not so good, um, which is always the case for me because I am prone to um, blemishes and stuff like that. It's about $20 I believe, so it's a little bit pricey, um, but I think it's worth it. You use a really, really small amount every time, so um, it lasts. The next thing I want to show you guys are teas. Um, I have a bit of an obsession with tea. I drink it pretty much every day, but I'm also very health conscious and there's a lot of companies out there that use artificial flavoring and coloring and stuff like that in their tea um, and that's just not something that I am into. So I'm pretty careful about where I buy my tea and I read all of the ingredients first. My favorite company for a long time was David's Tea because they make delicious tea and for a while they didn't have anything artificial in their teas, but um, they do have teas now that have artificial flavorings in them. I don't buy them. I always read the labels because they do still have organic teas and teas that don't contain anything artificial. So if you do go to David's and that's something that is important to you, make sure to read the labels. This is one of my favorite teas by David's Tea. It's called Gold Rush and it's a white tea and it's organic. Don't really know if showing the package does much for you, but maybe I can open it and show you what it looks like. This tea is really light. I like light teas and the caffeine level is low. It smells really good. You can't really smell it obviously, but it's got mulberries, coconut, um, silver needle white tea, and organic flavoring. So I know that a lot of people don't even want to use organic flavoring or natural flavoring because they aren't necessarily the most natural and it's not a whole food, but for tea I kind of let it slip because I have an obsession and I need tea. So another tea that I really like is Shanti Tea, that's the name of the brand. This is a candy cane tea that they have for Christmas this year. Um, they don't use anything artificial in any of their teas, it's all organic and it's all um, fair trade and everything, which is great. This one is like a mint type tea with spearmint, peppermint, stevia, safflower, and it actually says it has little candy canes in it, but I have yet to get a candy cane, so I don't know if I just got a defective batch, but there's no candy canes in this. It still tastes really good though, and it's still been one of my favorites for Christmas this year. And it just looks like a bunch of green, herby stuff. So yeah, another one of my favorites. This company is actually an Ottawa company, so they're local for me, but they do have a website that you can check out and order from if you'd like to try any of their teas. I've tried a bunch and they're all really good. The next thing that I want to show you guys is super exciting because I'm kind of obsessed with it. It is my Aromas Diffuser. This is what it looks like. Kind of get an up close look at it here. It's basically a nebulizing diffuser. So what that means is it doesn't use any water at all. Um, a lot of diffusers you have to fill a little reservoir with water and then put the oils in. Whereas this one, you just take the top off and you put the oils directly into the diffuser and it diffuses the oils um, and it doesn't put any water or humidity into the air. Um, if mold is something that you're really sensitive to, you might want to try avoiding any diffusers that put more humidity into the air because humidity can um, eventually create mold. So if you're very sensitive, this is a great one because there's no extra uh, moisture put into the air. It's just the oils. I got this about a month ago and I've honestly been using it every single day because I'm so obsessed with essential oils and just having the room smell really nice and I love that I can do it without having anything artificial 
if you buy pure essential oils, there's no artificial fragrances, there's no chemicals, nothing that's going to hurt you. And actually, it's been proven that essential oils have therapeutic benefits. So instead of getting negative health effects, you can actually use these to benefit your health. So this is amazing. Like I said, I use it every single day. And you can get this on Amazon, and I think they actually have them for sale on Etsy as well. They are $99 um, American, and so with Amazon you can get the free shipping. Um, totally worth it. An awesome, awesome diffuser. This one is set to do 10 minutes on and 10 minutes off for an hour, and then it shuts off, which I really like because sometimes I'll put my diffuser on and then I'll leave the room and I'll forget, and I don't want to be wasting oil. Also, if you want to use it right before bed, that's a great option because it will turn off by itself and it won't be diffusing all night long. They do have an option when you buy it as well where you can pick how long the timer goes on for. So mine is the shortest one, it's just one hour, but you can also get two hour, four hour, and I believe eight hour options. So if that's something that would interest you, then you just let them know at checkout and they can do that for you. So the Aromas Diffuser, this is what it looks like. You can also get all different like sizes and shapes of these glass bottles. And I believe they have a darker base as well, I just chose the lighter one. Um, but yeah, it's a cute little diffuser and it works really well and I've really been enjoying it. The next product that I'm going to show you is an Inner Echo product. Full disclosure, this is mine and my cousin's business, but I actually really like this product and I use it myself, so I wanted to show you guys. So these are our um, gift sets with our bracelets, our diffuser bracelets, and our High Vibe Elixirs, which look like this. So basically what it is, is it's a bracelet made up of gemstones. This is our calming bracelet. I'm trying to do like a close up here. So this is Jasper down here, and then this is Amethyst, and these beads here are Lavastone. So what's cool about these bracelets is that the Lavastone actually diffuses essential oils. So in the gift set, you also get an essential oil blend. This is the calming blend. Ooh, calming blend. So these are blends of essential oils and gemstones. So this particular blend has amethyst gemstones and lavender, roman chamomile, sandalwood, ylang ylang, and vanilla essential oils. And if you look at the back, you can see the little um, amethyst chips hanging out back there. So yeah, what you can do with these is they're actually a roll-on bottle, so you can roll the essential oils directly onto the lava stone, and it will actually diffuse your essential oils for several hours. And of course, you can also use this just on you. You can put it on pulse points, um, just kind of like as a perfume and for the therapeutic benefits. And these gift sets also come with our info cards for the oil blend. We have an info card that details all of the properties and how to use it and what's in it. And then for the bracelet, we have the info cards detailing all of the different properties of the gemstones materials used. And it comes in a cute little gift box that we hand stamp ourselves with our Inner Echo stamp. So that's cute. We sold quite a few of these this Christmas because they make great gifts, they're thoughtful, they're handmade, um, support small businesses, and these retail for 50 Canadian, so that's about, I think it's like 35 now American. The Canadian dollar really sucks right now, so for anyone purchasing from Canadian companies from the US, now's the time because the dollar sucks so bad that you'll get a great deal. <laughs> The last product that I want to show you guys is something that I've been using with my Aromas Diffuser um, the past week because I just got it for Christmas. And it is the Sage whoop, Sage Signature Selection Deluxe Diffuser Blend Collection. So this is a whole bunch of different essential oils. There's 10 of them in there. And I guess it's just a bunch of their popular diffuser blends. I am obsessed with this store. Um, we actually only have one in Ottawa right now but they're all over Canada and you can order online if you're in the US, but they're a completely natural store that sells all different products. They mainly focus on essential oils and essential oil blends, but they do have other products that just incorporate the essential oils into them, like shampoos and face cleansers and stuff like that. But honestly, you walk into the store and everything smells so amazing, it's impossible to leave without literally wanting every single item that you encountered. So I've been using these in my diffuser um, this week. What I do is I put about 15 drops of essential oil in my diffuser um, and it will diffuse for probably about two full hours with the 10 minute on, 10 minute off um, cycling. So I've really been enjoying these. If you haven't heard of Sage, I definitely recommend checking them out. They're an awesome company. And their packaging is really gorgeous too. That's what it looks like. Well, I kind of already showed you, but just take one more look because it's really beautiful. 
Okay, so that's everything that I wanted to show you guys today. I hope you liked this video and I hope you'll check out some of my favorite things. I hope everyone had an amazing Christmas and with New Year's coming up, I hope you have a great New Year's and an even better 2016. Bye guys!